spring, during the short-lived wave craze, there were so many new faces being seen on the Paris runways, it was rumored that many of the established supermodels were about to be pushed into early retirement. One of the new models attracting a lot of attention at that time was Amber Valletta, a 19-year-old from Tulsa, Oklahoma. I think this whole thing about new faces and superstars is silly because these girls worked really hard to get where they're at, and we've worked really hard to get where we're at, and in six months' time, there won't be a difference, I promise you. It's going to be who does the best job, period. <laughs> While most of the new faces seen last season have long disappeared, Amber's has been hard to miss. With a wide variety of looks to draw upon, she's become a highly sought-after cover girl and a top runway model. She has an amazingly beautiful face. That's, mm -hmm. I think, her biggest asset. I like her very, very much, and I think she's so... She has this color eyes, unbelievable. Uh, the eyes is grapefruit color. Grapefruits? What color are your eyes? I don't think they're grapefruit. <laughs> they're not they're green and yellow, I guess. Maybe they are grapefruit. <laughs> The modeling world is a nitpicking business when something as inconsequential as a haircut can change someone's life. But that's exactly what happened to Amber when, against the wishes of her agency, she cut off all her hair in a Twiggy style do and her career suddenly took off. I did something I wanted to do and it, I broke out of something and, and uh, too many people had told me not to do it and when I did do it, um, it worked and I think that's, I mean, it's it's not just with hair, it's with anything. I think if you do something you really want to do, it's going to work. I think Amber is elegant in a modern way. Divinely educated person. I think she's the best educated girl of all of them. Perfection. Mm -hmm. And there's something very elegant, very modern, very... I wouldn't say traditional at the same time, but she has a mix of both, you know, of old world elegance and modern late 20th century uh, attitude. People say, you know, when you get older, your horizons start to close. When you're young, they're wide open, but I don't think so, especially in this, what, I, what I've been given a chance to do. I, I feel like it's wide open. I can go anywhere. I don't feel American and bound to, to America's rules and laws, and I don't feel like I'm bound to France. I feel like I can go anywhere in the world. Maybe they won't let me in because I have an American passport, but I feel free. Just go!